So peaceful. Hello everyone and welcome back to the walkthrough. So continuing from the last part, I suppose we're looking for beach balls around these parts as well as side questing and maybe we'll end up playing around here. We'll see I guess as I continue to explore this place. Uh, yeah, I still don't have any sort of water though, I don't believe, yeah. But as for the beach balls, we're looking for red and white round ones. And we gotta give them to this guy over here. The question is though, if I am even capable of getting all the beach balls at this point in time. But I might have just missed them. And another thing is that is getting crab food from the barrels by hitting the barrels with something. I already got one from crossing that little tiny island at the southern portion of the, the map here. It was over at... right over here. Yeah, this this is right there. Yeah, that was one of the parts of crab food, but I guess I gotta find all the barrels as well for a side quest, or at the very least, just hit as many barrels as I need, up, as I guess they need four. And come to think of it, if you think about... Oh, that was just money! Okay, so that wasn't crab food. I was gonna say, if they all contain crab food, well, there's more barrels than what I need over here. But it looks like that there's just gonna be certain things that have crab food. We're just breaking barrels and getting money! I feel like I am Link from The Legend of Zelda. Uh, oh, wait. Uh, oh, did that barrel respawn, or is that just... Oh, no, that's another set, set of barrels. Oh, I'm hitting. Okay, I'm in. I'm hitting into the first barrel. No matter what. Okay. <laughs> There's more crab food. That's yeah, number three in our crabby dishes. I can't see. I want just. Okay, there we go. Oh no, that's that's way too hard. But maybe it'll work. It worked, and I didn't knock my eye out. Happy days. That is a. a that is a win for all. Oh wait, I'm in the putter again. I don't wanna, what if I just tap it with a wedge, just out of curiosity, rather than hitting it harder. Mm. Still works! So, that means I got all the crab food, right? Uh, wait, wait, no, 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 I, whoops. Oh, I didn't mean to... <laughs> items, yeah. Crab food, four bottled. Still don't have balls, though. This guy, oh, maybe the balls are aqua golf. We close little beach water crocs are fed. <laughs> We shall see what they mean by that when we get into there later. Yeah, but it's looking like I can't really get all the beach balls. I, I don't think there's any sort of uh, access to the other ones, because I don't see any other ones around here. Uh, I forgot who wanted the crab food, though. <laughs> um, this guy is depressing me. Nah, you're not the one. I think it was on the other side of the, the islands, actually. Something strong. That, oh, no, wait, it, it was you. Okay. I was wrong. I brought him, yes. We can dial a party up to three! Not eleven? Okay. Three crabs, that is! Oh, I see! Oh, ice cream, nice. And someone was looking- Oh yeah! Oh yeah! We're rocking out! Ooh! Ooh! Yeah! Woo! But who wanted the ice cream? I forgot who wanted that. Uh, hmm. We have to change- like, get a different CD for that. Give her an ice cream. Here you go. There we go. Yeah, I thought it was you. I got candy now. <laughs> it, is it is Zelda. We're doing a trading quest. Who, who wanted candy, though? This is kind of embarrassing. Would you happen to bring a pencil? And you want my scorecard? No. I Everyone wants something. Do you want candy? I've got a piece of Max's gear. Uh... Something sweet, okay, yeah, you want- that was the thing that I thought you wanted a coconut before. Which I guess is a little sweet, but not as sweet as this candy. Awesome-tastic. Woosh! Oh, he used it. What do I get? A oh, pencil! <laughs> okay, so I know who needs the pencil. <laughs> Maybe we're gonna end up being able to do all these side quests after all. And we don't have to- I mean, well, I was gonna say, I don't wanna say have to, because that sounds like I don't wanna play, but I mean, I wanna kinda try to keep things organized, like side quests one part, whole course another part. Because I got a pencil, but it's more like a souvenir, I guess, technically. <laughs> I got a, a trinket. I, 
<laughs> I don't know who wants that. <laughs> Changed my mind as soon as I bought it. Oh, wait, did I ever go in this building? Oh. We're going in this building now. Oh, I can buy something. Skimming woods. What is this? I can't buy them, but... Is that like to skip a ball across the water? I'll try and buy them. No, I can't. Beach Tunes. Okay, that's gotta be the CD that they're looking for. Or cassette, I'm not sure. I mean, it could be either or, based on that, that case. It looks kind of thick. Okay, so I'm gonna buy that for the quest later on. Uh, what do you have to say here? <laughs> Due to recent thefts, I'm not allowing anyone on, anybody on the course. Also, you can't even play the course? Until my wallet is returned, nobody plays! Unless Max Yaris wants to have her own. Okay, I, I think I'm getting an idea of what we need to do here. We've got to get over to Max Yards somehow, because I probably won't be able to play a course even if I talk to him. But okay, so I got a CD or something. We got a great price on the stereo, but these aren't really jar jams. Here's a CD or something. I'm not sure what I bought, but this is your kind of music, I figured. Yes. <laughs> got a drink now. Uh... Who wants to drink? Ridiculous new music. Uh, what? I just bought. I just brought the CD. You're, you're just impossible to please. Uh, you should have it around on the course. See your scorecards. Uh, okay, I didn't think so. Uh, what about you over here at this corner? Did you want a drink? It was supposed to be a fun day, and they are giving me this water. Oh. We need that for someone else at the other corner. Why couldn't I have something nice? Please don't air your personal grievances in public. It was supposed to be fun. You are ruining it for me! Dang it, Daddy! I've got a nice drink you can have. Thanks. You can have my old water. I didn't even touch it. Oh, so he traded drinks. So you, I, I didn't talk to them before, did I? Got anything to trade for a second bottle of water? Don't you dare, Buster! Mom told me to make sure you behave yourself today. So who's the one in control here? I don't... I like the beach. Me too. How often are you supposed to take your child to the beach? Uh, I just want to chat with you really quick. Try to mind it cannot hold the cream. Maybe there's some sort of trick to it. Want to give it a go? No. Sorry, you look like a golfer. Okay, <laughs> yes, I am a golfer. Sort of. At least some, some people would say I'm not, sir, but just barely. Okay, so I'm gonna, I guess I'm just trying to hold the green. <laughs> I'll, I'll take the water over to the other side. When I finish this, I suppose. I probably should have talked to these people a little bit earlier, but I was just looking around for other stuff. That should be okay. I think that's, that'll carry, right? Like if I go a little bit back and land it in the water because of the, the wind there? I think so. Just as long as I don't under hit too much, it should still carry it. Oh, that's a turtle over there. Oh, it didn't matter. <laughs> At least I think that's a turtle. I should hit a ball to that circle and see what it is. Very creative. I never would have done that. Uh, are you saying that you wouldn't have tried to carry that? Because that was actually a like a stock shot. <laughs> uh, anyway, let's try and get our other stuff going. Oh, geez. Get that spin back up. Okay. Uh, anything else? How did you do that again? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no, no, and I don't want to be facing this way, although I guess I was facing that way when I dropped the ball. But I want to try hitting into the circle really quick, uh, just to see what the poop is in that circle. I'm guessing it's another turtle. Uh, yep, it's a turtle. So I guess I could use that to uh, land it on the green. That actually made the ball softer, like land softer, so that probably was the intended way of doing it. But I did it another way and it worked just fine. Anyway, I got to deliver that water. So yeah, it's looking like all those blue things, like, you know, the blue text blurbs on top of their heads are indicative of the trading thing. At least that's what it seems like. Could be wrong, though. Because uh, I thought this one was uh, thirsty. Yeah, like, see, this one, it has white. But, so what's the difference between the blue and white? I don't know. I don't know, but I do have water. If you could bring me some water, I've got some water for you, you're welcome! <laughs> I may have embarrassed my- no, really? I don't know, it's just, just thirst, it's a survival instinct. I had some frankly dangerous thoughts, yes, you shouldn't drink the seawater, as I said last part. Oh no, he's telling us stories, for instance. I thought I'd be able to hit a ball onto each of these small islands. I think that's possible. <laughs> 
Mm, I've had a good duo. <laughs> now you're starting to sound delirious. You want this water back? Fine, I'll be responsible for you. I'll let you ask me one more time then. Then I'm going to say yes. Hello? Uh -oh. Fine, I don't say I didn't warn you. <laughs> How many islands to hit to for? I'm going to try the hardest one first, I guess, probably. Oh, I, I thought I'm gonna, I was going to end up having you hit the, this one. Oh, well, that's actually going to make things significantly easier then. Because I don't have to hit to the tiny little patch of fairway and try to land it on there. Oh, no, 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 you just land it in some fluffy rough. And we got some even trees as a backstop over here. Uh, I guess, like, back there. I was way, way too fast on my control stick handling there. So I'm going to land it to hit the tree, please. Oh. I said, we're gonna land it and hit the tree, please. Or maybe I should try it like uh, this with the hit point mode. Yeah, I'll try that. It should give me a little bit more stopping power. Yeah, couldn't hurt at least. At least I would think. Hit the tree, hit the tree. Oh, oh. Is that out or in? It's out! Ah! <laughs> I'll aim for those two trees. Maybe I'll have better luck uh, with their bouncing. I got a lot of. A lot of room for error here, because it gave me 10 shots to start with. I don't think I thought this one was actually going to be the easiest one to land the ball on, but <laughs> it apparently is not. Uh, aim more that way, I guess. Go back a little smidge. Try it there. Oh, I forgot to change the hit point mode. Well, <laughs> if it hits the trees, it should stay in. Not if it hits it at that angle. Ah! <laughs> Hit point mode? Yes, yes. That'll. I think the hit point mode is actually messing with me a little bit too, because it is. Uh, oops, it's uh, changing how the. Oh, I <laughs> hit the front bank. Because <laughs> it's changing how it reacts to the wind. Um. And yeah, this is actually turning out to be the hardest one somehow. Uh, okay. Come on, we can do this. Oh shoot. I said we could do this, but I might just go over again. Ah! <laughs> I really gotta do something to stop the ball there. Wait, wait, couldn't I, like, land it on this? And then get it to stop on the other side? Why didn't I think of that before? Like, you know, a little ricochet bounce shot off the ground? Oh, I forgot to take into account the wind. Well, I don't have enough shots now, so I might as well just do this really quick. <laughs> Alright, I'll try for that other island first. That, you know, the hardest one? I have not returned to sanity yet. I will show you that this can be done, even if I have to dig a, in a hole through the center of the earth with divots. I will show you the power of pure persistence. <laughs> okay, land on the fairway. And uh, I didn't land it as far as I wanted it over, but yeah, that would that would definitely work. Uh, okay, just need to get it a little bit closer to the edge, and then it should bounce over. All right, there we go. I was gonna say there we go, but there we know. <laughs> okay, let's try just a little smidge back this time. Oh, that might be too much. Go ball, go! Hit the front. Oh! oh. Hmm. <laughs> well, that would be one way of playing this island, but you know what? I'll try something else here. I'm gonna go to a, a two wood and change my roll, like, so I have a further rollout when it lands. I'll also cut through the wind a little bit. So, let's see if I can get myself to do a nut. <laughs> this is a lot harder than I was expecting for sure. But oh no, it's it's gotta be doable. I have faith that this is doable. I mean, if, if there's circles, you can probably hit to those circles. Okay. <laughs> okay, so in theory, I should have it now because I think that was the hardest one. Um, wait, hold on a sec. You could oh, you could choose the oh, there's more circles than you need to hit to. Ah, oh, I didn't even need to hit that for that one. Oh! I thought there was only four circles. I never counted them. Well, well, this is embarrassing. <laughs> it should be quite easy then, because I can 
just gonna land them to whichever islands I see will be the easiest to land them on then. Like, maybe that upper right one is like a trolling trap or something like that. Because that one was exceptionally hard to land the ball on. Uh... Hmm... Should I trust this one to just land it on the fly, like on the front edge? Or should I try and bounce it off of this like I did the other one? Something tells me I should try bouncing it off of this. Something tells me... Although I could just go for that island and back, but I'm not sure how, how precise I can land that on the sand. Well, I'll just go for that one, just, just to give it a shot, because I got an idea of how I want to island hop, literally. Uh -huh. mm, well, I, I guess I could have just landed it there on the fly then, if it's going to land that softly, but... Okay, just, just experimenting. I don't know all the game's physics just yet. <laughs> Like, I've all, from that distance, I've always landed my ball in the rough. Oh, like, like, something like that, but I didn't think I'd be able to pull that off, because it's... Because that's such, like, a tiny area. But yeah, if I'm trying to aim for a green at that distance, I'm trying to hit the ball into the rough, so it just, like, shimmies along and lands itself happily onto the green. I think I might be made delirious again. No! Of course it's easy to hit them. Hitting off them is the hard part! <laughs> <laughs> I suppose, because you gotta get there, and you gotta not be intimidated by the water. Oh wait, am we gonna actually hit off them though? Yes, I can. Of course not. <laughs> just wanted to try it. Don't say I didn't warn you. So, we're just hitting to the green in the middle? Oops. Okay. <laughs> that actually should not be too difficult, although I thought it was... I thought the other one was gonna be... Uh, easy, and then I was just flumming things up because I wasn't thinking things through all that well, but... Details! Details. Yeah, just land it on the front edge. I'm not gonna change my uh, hit point mode or anything like that. It just seems like it, from these short distances, it, it'll have enough stopping power. As long as I get it to plop right on the front edge of the green or so. And I got, an, I got a general idea of how the wind affects my ball and stuff. Oh, nailed it! <laughs> so I don't think I'll have much issue with that. Uh, I could always use the pin as a backstop, I suppose. If all else fails in certain situations, but I, I'm, you really shouldn't be aiming for that. You should always just be aiming for the nice, soft patch of green. Because the pin is pretty thin. <laughs> But, I mean, it, the pin can always be a possibility if you really should need it. Oops, I hit the front bank. Oh, and I don't even get another chance at it. Uh, I was pretty close, though. But close is no cigar giver or something like that. <laughs> and that looks pretty good. Oh, I was going to say, I hit that pretty close. But anyway, I got the five out of five anyway. So I'll just land this one on there really quick. This is like a little chip shot. <laughs> yeah, easy little chips. So now what do you have to say about that? Well then, still delirious? <laughs> yeah! You got anything else? I think I've been in the sun too long. <laughs> well, I showed you it's possible. You may not believe your own eyes. But I assure you, it's possible. Uh, I'm just checking to see if there's any new dialogue. I don't have any more beach balls, but you might have the dialogue. Every single... Uh -huh. Find the, yeah, I don't have five beach balls. So it looks like I'm done side questing for now, unless I just so happen to come across some other ones, but I don't think so. It looks like that they will be forcing me over to playing around on the course before I can make progress and other stuff. I probably gotta make a decent score to impress the coach. So with that, I'm going to end off the part here. I hope you enjoyed, and I will see you in the next part when I get my round started. Maybe, at least I, I think maybe I'll be able to get a round started in the next part. Because remember that person in the little house there said not letting anyone out on the course because of the theft and, you know, you need the wallet. So maybe we'll have to figure that out. I don't know. We'll see.